Hello my friends, I will be testing my new Ryzen 7 CPU with multiple idle and clicker games. First on the screen is uh, Clicker Heroes. I always keep it running in the background. I have more than 2000 hours in Steam. A second game is Crusaders of the Last Idol. It's uh, another good game with a lot of quests. And the story are very funny. Uh, I choose idle games because they are CPU intensive instead of using the video card. Okay, so the utilization is still in 17%. The third game I'm opening is a uh, Guild Quest. I have no background music in this video because I will be using the music in the treasure room of guild quest there guild quest and let's go to the treasure vault for good music uh, next i'll be opening is the uh, idling to rule the gods it's a uh, very text heavy game there is barely no graphics at all there all text and that's the only graphics you can see <laughs> the completion bar next we will be opening is insanity clicker it's a clone of Clicker Heroes with a horror theme. There, as you can see in the screen, even the interface is similar to Clicker Heroes. Next game will open is a Midas Gold Plus. It's a new game and has plenty of gimmicks or side quests, and it's very entertaining. Midas Gold. set up for a while there you go it's a theory. next game would be time clickers with six games open we are already at 50% CPU in my previous PC <laughs> I can only play four or five at a time I'm very happy with this right set. Okay, next game is a uh, Tap Tap Infinity. It's almost a clone of Clicker Heroes. And I am expecting to see some graphical error in the recording. There you go. We are at 60% utilization. I don't know what the cause of graphic glitch is. Also another is Ragnarok Clicker. It's developed by the same developers of Clicker Games. And that's the plugin music of Ragnarok Clicker. Here I will show you in the screen. There, it also causes graphic glitch because it has the same I don't know with Insanity Clicker and Clicker Heroes. So that's nine games <laughs> open and we are at 72%. Now to top it off and end this video, <laughs> let's start Counter Strike.
and let's see <laughs> if I can still play. Now, eighty percent. Okay, Counter Strike. Total of ten games running. Still at eighty percent. Let's play some casual. Or oh, maybe it will not reach ninety percent. While loading Counter Strike, it reached eighty, but I guess. Did not go that high again. Oh, let go to eighty percent. So maybe I'll end this video here. As you can see, <laughs> Ryzen Seven can play ten games, nine idle games, and your main game with no problem at all. The one causing the graphic glitch is only in the recording, not in my actual games. So, thank you for watching. Hope you like this video. And please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.